Hey guys, it's Char and welcome back to The Sims 4 Get to Work. So we are right back where we left off and we are just dancing here with Ashlyn. She just looks like she just stayed in her clothes all day. And she's like, hey dad, how's everything going? I still miss mom. Look at her. What is going on right now? What happened? <laughs> what happened? Like seriously, I have no idea. So the kids are over here eating some pizza. Um, and Andrew is over here complaining about his bills he's like you are the reason why my bills are super high you only brought in 200 and what simoleons that is nothing and he's just like dude don't even talk to me i'm the one wearing the freaking chief of police hat over here <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and um pay our bills so let's see so 2000 and some that is a lot of freaking money ashlyn needs to figure it out though she's watching tv she really wants to be a cook like her mom i guess um her mom was a very very good cook that's why she has these really nice cookbooks over here <laughs> she is feeling super energized um from what it seems to be the decorations in the bedroom but i think it's really great that she wants to just kind of follow in her mom's footsteps just a little bit she was definitely a mama's girl and i just i don't know i don't I don't like blame her at all for trying to really just be the woman of the house for both her, her little sister and her dad. And he came over here to talk to her, probably to ask her about how school was and all that good stuff. And it looks like Drake then went on off to bed and poor Dax is like, I don't have nobody to talk to. I have to live here with these people who I don't even know. Like what is life right now? What is life? <laughs> <laughs> but right now I'm going to have um, Ashlyn go and maybe travel and just go somewhere. She doesn't um, have any friends really from, oh, I forgot she met Grim Reaper. So I don't know. Maybe we will run into him again. Who knows? But she doesn't have any friends. I mean, she does know of her dad's um former co-worker and all of that jazz but i really want her to maybe make some friends you know maybe a potential lover i mean um boyfriend <laughs> we're gonna go here to gold street alley so i will meet you guys once we get there so we are finally here at gold street alley um this is supposed to be like a teenager kind of lot teeny bopper kind of thing but of course a bunch of adults are here right now i don't know if um i don't know i remember editing the lot but i remember um just kind of having this great idea to make it a kids teenager kind of clothing store so there's that stuff so right now i don't know oh so she can purchase out oh that is amazing so if you guys don't know because i just found out you can definitely have a clothing store and make it into a bar and you can still purchase stuff that is amazing so right now i'm going to I guess send her on downstairs as you can see this is where the party is at so at night it's a bar and during the day it's supposed to be kind of like more so your retail lot see look there's a little kid here like you're not even supposed to be here lauren pancakes oh so another thing um you will notice or recognize a couple people in the town that i have edited so some of them you have seen before have now have kids and all that stuff. So this is um, Bob Pancakes and Eliza's daughter over here who should actually be in bed because it is 10 p.m. But she's cute. So anyways, it doesn't seem to be any teenagers here. And um, she is a party animal. So let's go ahead and serve up some food. Let's go ahead and serve all for 250 simoleons. And maybe get to know people because we are, are we hungry at all? Um, we are hungry, so why don't we go ahead and have some, uh, let's see, sausage and peppers. Let's go ahead and try this ceviche over here, and why don't we talk to this guy, because I think he was one of the people we questioned in one of the parts with Drake, and I think he's kind of attractive, and he thinks he is too. He is super cute, and I don't know, maybe Ashlyn might like the older men, who knows? But we're going to 
show off our outfit because you know we're we're really cute you know we're probably about maybe 18 so it's it's kind of legal it's legal to talk to him he might be 22 so it's all good don't i look good uh-huh how you doing let's tell a dramatic story and um give him a pep talk why don't we give him a treat Ooh, yes treat you to this <laughs> So it looks like we have a new bartender now. Her name is uh, Desiree Tashman. There is a lot of dudes here. Is there any music playing at all? I really cannot hear it whatsoever. I have no idea if there is anything playing. So let's go ahead and maybe change to new age and see if we can hear something better. A little bit, a little bit. Let's go ahead and continue to talk to this guy. Let's tell him an engaging story. And he's cute too. Hold on, don't walk away yet. He's kind of cute too, I like him. He's adorable, but this guy over here, he is hotness. His name is Tyrell. Boyer, Bayer, Bayer, Bowser. <laughs> I don't know, but let's go ahead and brighten his day. And um, let's see if he's single. And why don't we go ahead and go a little further and compliment his appearance. I mean, she is a little, you know, crazy and spontaneous. And, you know, her mom is not around anymore. So she's just kind of maybe doing things that maybe she shouldn't be doing, you know, if her mom was around so let's go ahead and order ourselves a what in the world is this amy g delight what is this it looks like freaking a protein shake it looks like it has some kale up in there and we are all about the figure and the body so why not so can you finish eating please and thank you so we're going to go ahead and have ourselves a little bit of a drink and just kind of party the night away a little bit. And she is feeling pretty tired. So is this a coffee thing? Maybe visit our mom at the cemetery before we head on home. So I really would like her to hurry up with this plate of food. I don't understand why it's taking her 10 years to eat a plate of something that doesn't even fill up her needs like seriously and then the plate is gone but we're going to go ahead and make us some tea really quickly so i'm just going to forward this a little bit so go ahead and grab yourself a cup of that so hopefully it will get her her energy up a little bit but i'm quite sure she's going to have to use the bathroom after a while too so i'll go ahead and send her right on over there as well so let's see if there's anybody on upstairs and i'll go ahead and show you guys the rest of the lot so as you can see the party is definitely downstairs and i love this lot i think it's super cute i definitely did my own tweaks by adding in like a um a little atm in the back a little whatever this is <laughs> and a hot tub because hello teens love to have fun and why not like have a hot tub that just defines fun for sure so we had this little thing up here another bathroom and just like a seating area and then an area outside as well so let's go ahead and check back on Ashlyn. So she's really tired. Everybody has kind of gone. The coffee or tea or whatever has not really seemed to work. So we're going to go ahead and travel on over to hopefully the cemetery. And I will meet you guys once we get to the lot. Hey guys, so we are actually back at the house. I decided that it would be best for her to maybe visit her mom another night. Maybe with her 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 dad and her sister or something like that and um drake drake i need for you to not do that can we turn off can she can they sleep with the music on i'm not sure but um i think it would just be best for her to visit the cemetery and see her mom with like her dad and her sister maybe or maybe just her sister i don't know but as for angel he needs to go ahead and get himself one ready for bed and all that stuff because he does have work today and we will be going with him to the career lot but anyways i'm just going to go ahead and fast forward until his work day so i will meet you guys once we get there 
So we have finally arrived to work with Angel and it says clinical orientation. Welcome Angel Green to a vital and rewarding career in the field of medicine. Being new to the job, take some time getting familiarized with the location, the people and the basic responsibilities of the profession and time with skill, dedication and a passion to help his fellow Sims. Angel will no doubt go far in his career. So, um... I'm thinking of maybe downloading a new lot. Um, let's not do that. Downloading a new lot um, for the hospital career. I did find one that I thought was really, really nice. So I will probably go ahead and maybe test that out off camera and see how much I like it. So right now it says grab a snack between seeing patients, greet two coworkers, and chat with a patient. So since we're already over here, let's go ahead and grab a snack, maybe have ourselves something very simple and easy without having to use the microwave. So we'll just go ahead and grab ourselves a soda, which will probably make them have to use the bathroom anyway. So we have this lady, her name is Savannah Lucero. I love that name and she looks kind of pretty. So let's go ahead and maybe do a friendly introduction. So Angel definitely wants to chat with his youngest daughter, Jamie. And I mean, that is his little girl. He wants her to be his little girl forever. And I don't blame him. I don't, I also don't understand why he's bald. If anyone has any idea how I can fix this, please do tell because I have no idea. Oh, who's this kid? Angelo Toshman. Oh, you must be the son of that girl we saw. Let's see, so chat with a patient. So why don't we go ahead and chat with this kid since he is standing right next to us. Let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction. Let's not talk to her. So we're gonna do a friendly introduction. Can you, excuse me, ma'am, please. I know, we're attractive, aren't we? I mean, you're not too bad looking yourself. But let's go ahead and chat with him. And we need to chat with another coworker. So let's see, I know I saw somebody over here. I do not know where you are okay so there's this guy oh he looks really really cute he is a nurse his name is trent aranda i am loving these names i think he's kind of cute like seriously um so we have sage dowdy such a pretty name as well carter leon oh my goodness i love it i love it <laughs> Um, and then we have this old guy over here, Jaquan. He does not even look like a Jaquan, but I love it. He is so cute. Such a cute little old man. Yay. We also have to deliver food to a patient. So since we're here, let's go ahead and admit this little boy as well. And then we have this guy over here. So let's go ahead and do all that jazz. He did not have to get up. Why did you just do that? What? What even? Oh, but well, we're going to go ahead. Oh, look at his little outfit. <laughs> Let's go ahead and give him some food and see if he's hungry. And we have to chat with another co-worker. So why don't we go ahead and maybe talk to this guy and just uh, maybe ask him about his career and all that good stuff. So let's go ahead and make this a little fast as well. So it says, Angel has learned that Jaquan is a community gardener at Gardens for All. Nice. So chat with some more co-workers and make a bed. But they're okay. So we can go ahead and make this bed as well. <laughs> and let's see so i wish there were more people here like there seems to be only two co-workers so it just seems like it's just pretty basic right now just kind of doing the same old same so the only thing that i wish that we could do with get to work is just kind of do our own thing you know instead of having to bounce all around the hospital and you know just basically do a bunch of repetitive things we have to get another snack this is craziness he would rather just work out Let's go over here and take his temperature. So Angel's work day will be ending. Can we shoo him? Can we tell him to like kind of... I don't want to be mean though. But we can't make up another bed. Like we seriously can't. Complain? Okay, we're going to have to complain. Like because I really want this... I really want him to finish up his day like successfully unlike his brother you know angel is very ambitious and career oriented so this says angel has successfully performed a practice examination on a patient the test results seem valid but the specific data is a bit over his head and will be passed along to a physician for diagnosis it was a good learning experience though so let's go ahead and 
Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go ahead and ask a coworker about his day. I am so glad you are standing right next to us because you are so convenient right now. Are we gonna make it? Are we gonna make it? Okay, with seven minutes. Yes! I'm super excited. So we're gonna go ahead and speed on through. So he got um 188 simoleons. Angel did a fantastic job today. Promotions and community health are surely in the future. So we're going to go ahead and head on home and I will meet you guys once we get there. Alrighty guys, so we are finally back at the house and it has been a successful day i'm going to go ahead and pause this here while he wants to go ahead and do <laughs> do some sit-ups actually let me check on dax who is just messing with this little bear over here um he is super cute but anyways i'm going to go ahead and wait a minute one sure hopes ashlyn's weekend plans include focusing on schoolwork Receiving such low grades could affect her future. Dax is back from school. Friday nights are great for turning B's into A's. He could focus on that perhaps. But I'm going to go ahead and end this part right here. I thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And until my next video, I will see you guys all later. Bye. Oh, Ashlyn.